Two, what's going on, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of the Two for the World Show, the platform where we create us is Actual Factuals. I'm your host, William Zillions. Um, man, it's just, yo, it's some really interesting, messed up stuff happening right now. Earlier last week, uh, the city of uh, Louisville, Kentucky, settled $12 million with Breonna Taylor's family uh, for a wrongful death lawsuit. They settled. You know what I'm saying? According to the news that I read, the um, the family wanted to pursue criminal charges. The attorney general apparently had to is about to make some sort of announcement, apparently, on whether or not they're going to uh, bring up bring up charges on the three officers who basically botched this whole situation and and murdered and, and murdered an American, right? So right now on the table. There's a, a new memorandum that just got released calling for a state of emergency for the LMPD, uh, the police the police officers in uh, Louisville, Kentucky, that basically says that all paid, all vacation plans, all like days off, all of that shit's been canceled for all cops. They're calling in like the, um, what do you call it? The National Guard, like they're preparing for Whatever this, whatever the announcement from the attorney, the attorney general is going to be Daniel something. I forget his last name. They haven't made the official announcement, but if they're gearing up and already saying that it's a state of emergency, yo, I really can't even imagine the politicians really wanting to have a good relationship between the people and the police officers with shit like this. And no one's going to talk about this on the news. No one's going to speak about this, but. The city of Lu of Louisville apparently would rather call for a state of emergency, uh, have have law enforcement in this hyper state of like violence as a method of response to whatever might happen. They would rather take a loss to the budget of the city rather than lock up three police officers who did the wrong thing one day. On this channel, I talk sometimes about uh, ending qualified immunity. And qualified immunity, as we discussed, you know, a couple times before, it's just a legal defense. This is this is one of the strongest methods in which police officers are able to get off whenever they do all of this fuck shit, right? Now it protects police officers, but equally, no. And and I think it's interesting that all of the discussions about ending it are only talking about ending it for police officers, but it equally protects individuals who are elected officials of the of the executive branch of government there's a lot of responsibility on the hands of people who are elected officials and it's like how can something how can a decision so inhumane be even up on the table why would we prioritize the keeping out of jail of of three clearly criminal people officers police officers clearly criminal what the hell is an investigation you understand what is an investigation at this point how long has it been the murder happened in uh march what was what month is this right now september and what don't we know <laughs> what don't we know you feel me what what isn't confirmed so at this at this point right now if the attorney general is seriously considering not arresting these arresting these officers not bringing ju not ho not upholding justice within the state then like what is his penalty what is his penalty there has to be somebody held responsible for this it can't just be the, pol the people versus the police all the time it can't just be the people versus the police all the time that shit is dangerous and everybody's bitching about the cops but really the cops are just the mad dogs off the leash and they owners, and we all know who the owners is, the cops, the cops' sole purpose is to protect state property, not people. These memorandums, the, the bills, the, the, the effort, the quickness, the pace that they were able to get a, something legible signed to a call of action. Y'all would rather put that effort into hyper-policing something that's overly avoidable. <laughs> I don't even understand what our leadership is calling fair these days i don't know what our leadership is calling just i don't really know what our leadership considers to be american 
but I will say on a on a level of just like what we supposed to be upholding as citizens of this so-called free world that we live in, first class citizen type shit, Mr. Attorney General. If you choose not to provide justice to this to these to this family, you are wrong, bro. And I think that's like a crime against humanity to be able to uphold injustice. Upholding injustice is fucking unconstitutional. Personally, as an individual, I am actively seeking opportunities to hold responsible these people that have the power to do what's easily correct. Have the power to do what's even resourcefully responsible. Calling for a state of emergency, canceling people's family time, the mental stress that cops claim that they have all the time on the job, that whole fear element that we all gotta deal with as citizens. You think it's gonna be even better now that they that they that they're in a state of emergency? Now that they got their chief of police parking down their neck telling them that they gotta be hardcore again? And I think it starts with getting rid of the people who are in these positions of leadership and eliminating qualified immunity for both police officers and the executive branch. Politicians should not be able to just get off. States should not have to sue Washington. They should be able to sue your ass as an individual. All right, man. Like I said, I'm not going to chew your ear off. Uh, it's been another episode of the Two for the World Show. The platform where we create us is Actual Factuals. I'm your host, William Zillions, and uh, stay true, it's still Two for. Fabry higher, don't you mute your love for nobody. Nobody. Tell you nothing, fuck out of here, go for your win, no need for you to slow up. For none of these nobodies. Close so up, to your dreams and go up. Said nobody, 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 nobody. Fabry higher, don't you mute your color, 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 color.